Hey, Tom Rabbit, I hope you got this for your recording. Hey, YouTube out there, Tom Rabbit likes to record these. Hey, Tom Rabbit. But if, but if, but if you don't believe in cause and effect, then what you just show, if you don't believe in cause and effect, you just showed me randomness. Okay. Hey, Layman, do you, do you realize why this is a fruitless endeavor? Okay. Oh, hey, Darth. Yeah, go ahead. Okay, this is a fruitless endeavor. Let me tell you why, okay? It's because the position that he holds to is not something that is dictated by reason, okay? The position that he holds to is dictated by a what I like to call a prime directive, which is a Star Trek reference, okay? His, his prime directive is to preserve his autonomy at all costs. So no matter what reasoning you throw at him, he will just find some rabbit hole to run down to. And I can demonstrate to you right now, okay? I can demonstrate, please don't over talk. I can demonstrate right now, please don't over talk me. I thought it was me too that I said, please don't over talk me, okay? Please don't over talk me. Okay. I can demonstrate right now, okay? To everybody listening, everybody in the room, this, this is exactly what I said it is, okay? Now, Wild Heart, do you have a, a reason why you don't believe in God? Yes, the reason is I haven't been convinced that God exists. <laughs> okay, now, you have given us a criterion of belief that because it's unfulfilled, therefore you are dismissive of God. Now, when one claims not to believe in God, they're not in a vacuum. So you do believe that because you just lit your cigarette or your joint, you believe in the regularity. Just tobacco, no, no drugs. Okay, all right. So your behavior that we just saw on the screen shows that you have a firm belief in the regularity of nature, okay? Now, I think you would, you, you, you would have, listen to me. Before. I'm, I'm trying to walk you through something here, okay? I'm going to demonstrate to yourself that your criterion of belief that you've just given us is a psychological masquerade, okay? I'm going to prove it. Cool. Okay? Now, when you don't believe in God, you therefore don't believe in anything. You Ooh, believe, okay, listen mission. to me, that's please don't I'm interrupt me. I'll, I'll, I'll give you well, plenty of I, opportunity I, 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 to I, I, respond. No, I'll give you plenty of opportunity to respond. I, I'll okay? forget it. I'm yes, trying to get to a point. I'm trying to get to a point, okay? I'm trying to get to a point. 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 Okay? Now. So I have to let you finish. There are two worldviews. I'm trying to get to a point. See, this is why it's so difficult to talk with atheists. It's because they preserve the prerogative for themselves to bicker. Okay? Now. I'm trying to get to a point here. Now, there's only two basic worldviews. There's the God world and the not God world, okay? This is uncomplicated, and it's really uncontra- Okay, shut the fuck up, will you? Exactly. Okay. If you talk one more time, I'm going to mute you. Now, there's two basic worldviews. There's the God world and the not God world. They can be stated explicitly or they can be held to implicitly. Wild Heart holds either explicitly or implicitly to the not God world. He says, because he's a man of reason and he really wants to believe the truth, that if he just simply had evidentiary support for the God world and it was provided sufficient evidentiary support, he would believe in it. Okay. But in the absence of evidence or support, he withdraws belief in God and he dismisses belief in God. But he consequently believes in the not God world. But you see, there's no evidentiary support for the world of naturalism. There's no 
um, evidentiary support for the not God world. Now, the proof of this is that when we ask Wild Heart and other atheists, and by the way, I've asked professional atheists at this as well, they will say, well, the reason why I do believe in the not God speak. world, okay, let me finish, please. The reason why Wild Heart and even other atheists, including professional atheists, believe in the not God world is that they will say, well, because I don't have a reason to believe in the God world. But you see, this is a form of fallacious reasoning. It, it's called an appeal to ignorance. Now, Wild Heart, I'm gonna ask you a simple question, okay? Listen carefully, it's a simple and clear question. What is the evidentiary support that the not God world is true? Can I Go ahead, Wild Heart. Can, can I just say that I just want yes, to know sport. what a professional atheist is? Who gets paid for I'm being talking here? about I'm talking about atheists who have um, can you not keep putting up on that thank you when, when I refer to as professional atheists I'm talking about those atheists who have earned PhDs in a variety of disciplines and who go out on the lecture or debate circuit and are very vocal that, in promoting their atheism okay that's now okay let's, here's the quite here's the question listen carefully I'm going to prove to you and to everyone in the room and everybody listening that you are not sincere about your criterion of belief because no. you do not deploy this criterion of belief when it comes to the not God world. Okay. So here we go. What is the evidentiary support that the not God world is true? Can I say, and I apologize for time wasting, but I, 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 I'm I, not sure what the God world and the not God world is. And okay. I'm, the I'm God saying, world I'd is like we to, have like God is that. I will explain it to you. I'd like I, to interject. I, I, like I will to, explain I'd it like, to you. I'd like to interject the, here. The God is. Like yeah, to, yeah, shut yeah, up. I can't, I can't deal please. with Ronan. Okay. No, Ronan no, is I, problematic. I'm asking okay. That okay. So, Praise, can you please take care? Can you just remove Ronan temporarily, please? Okay, so wild heart. Okay, thank you. Yeah, Ronan. Ronan is is a mental case. Oh, okay. I like Ronan. I, I have. Yeah, well, I don't. Okay. Um. Uh. So. Um. The God world is the idea that what is fundamental to everything, okay, is a self-contained eternal mind that is the source and basis of why anything else exists and exists in the form that it does. The not God world is just simply that there is not an identifiable absolute that is a mind that institutes and secures why everything is what it is, okay? Now, I will ask, that is what you do believe. Now, what is the evidentiary support for the not God world that it is true? Right, I'll, I'll answer this the best that I can, and it's just due to my stupidity and lack of intelligence that if I answer it wrong, it's not, I'm not being dishonest. Uh, I would say that there are some things that just, if you give someone just one true fact, there are some things that you can't determine just off that one fact, whether it's a God thing or a not God thing, it's, it's indeterminate. No, wild heart, you need to focus instead of filibustering, okay? I'm now, when I ask this question, I when I sense. ask this question, Sorry. all I get people doing is filibustering. I will ask the question, I will shut up, and I have an expectation that you will directly answer the question instead of filibuster, okay? Now, what is the evidentiary support that the not God world is true? Uh, I would say, based on your definition of the God world, the God world would say that every true fact. No, Wild Heart, I didn't ask you about the God world. I will repeat the question no, again. This to... inevitably happens with unbelievers, okay? They dodge, they dance, they filibuster. They, they like ask for qualifications, they ask for definitions. Not, I'll repeat the question I'm again. Sure. What is the evidentiary not. support? Yeah, why don't you shut up for a second? Okay. Because I'm the one who's asked the question several times and every time you open up your mouth, you're not directly answering the question. Now, what is the evidentiary support that the not God world is true? The evidentiary support is that some questions do not directly 
tell you whether a god exists or not. So you are saying that... The, <laughs> okay, the okay, god good. Wild heart, wild heart. Is there... I want to ask you a simple question. Listen, I've been through this hundreds, if not thousands of times over the last no. 12 years with atheists, no. okay? Yeah. Now, all I want is a yes or no out of you, and then we can move on, okay? okay. Do you have evidentiary support that the not God world is true? Yes. Okay. What is the evidentiary support that the not God world is true? The evidentiary support is that some things do not indicate necessarily. <laughs> I don't know why people are laughing. Okay. What so is the stupid. evidentiary support? So okay. What is the evidentiary support? See, when we talk about God, the God world, or yeah. the not God world, these are both universals. Yeah. Well, okay, you, you, okay. You Wild heart, please. I'm um, going through this. Please, let's not then bicker. Like Wild heart, please. My Stop. Okay. Do you understand no. that when we we talk about the God world versus the not God world, these are both mm -hmm. universals? Do you understand that? Yeah, that is okay. my point. So yeah. if I say, if I invoke that God is. Yeah. then God is the creator, the supreme being, the creator who institutes and secures all that is that is not himself. Yeah. In the not God world, we have a plurality of things that simply exist for whatever reason, okay, without reference or dependence upon God. They're both universals, okay? Are there now, only two options? Okay, um, what, okay uh, listen uh, carefully. See, this is uh, what happens I'm every asking, single asking. times with atheists. Let me finish. Okay, what, okay. Wild Heart? What is the evidentiary support that the universal of the not God world is true? Right. I would say if you're saying there's only two possibilities, a God world and a not God world, I would say the fact that some truths do not indicate whether it's a God world or a not God world would be proof that it's not a God world because it goes against your definition of God I'm, world. I'm not clear as to what you're saying. What is the right. evidentiary support for a not God world is true? Right. If you're saying there are only two options, a God world or a not God world, if some piece of if, if one truth is not determinative of whether it's a god world or a not god world that would be de a demonstration that the not god world is true because you're saying that every truth must indicate a god okay. so let me get this straight not... let me get this straight are you saying because you don't have a reason or evidentiary support for the god world therefore the not god world no, I'm saying that every, if, every, if every, every truth does not indicate a God world, that will be evidence against the God world, because you're saying every truth must indicate a okay. God world. Okay, so, so, in the the instance, that will so be are you saying, evidence. listen carefully, okay? Yeah. yeah. Are you saying in the absence of evidentiary support for the God world, therefore the not God world? I'm, because you have defined the God world as every hey, wild heart. This isn't complicated. This isn't rocket surgery. Listen I'm carefully not. to me. Listen carefully. You need to focus like a laser beam on my words. Right. Are you saying, okay, we, in the absence of evidentiary support for the God world, therefore the not God world? Yes, because of the way okay, you stop, the God stop, world. stop. Okay, now. That's what you have just committed, what you have just, listen carefully to me. The reasoning that you have just committed yourself upon examination is what we call an appeal to ignorance, okay? So put, we have two propositions. Listen carefully, okay? Listen to me carefully. Please put your hand down. Why don't you see, this is the problem that so many atheists have. You're so accustomed to bickering you just, won't even just, listen. Just so listen listen carefully. Can I, can I listen to me I, 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 carefully. You see, this is what they, this, listen, this is why it's so frustrating to deal with you as a grown man. Now listen to me carefully. If we have two propositions, A or not A, if I say to you, I believe in A because I'm unpersuaded, or excuse me, if I believe in not A, solely on the grounds because I'm unconvinced of A, okay? That's called an appeal to ignorance. Yes, I You do. believe that the not God world, not A, is true because you're unconvinced of A, the God no. world. It's not okay. because I'm unconvinced. Okay, so, so, That's not what like is it. the evidentiary support for the not God world is true? 
the evidentiary support is that you define the God world as every truth must. No, 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 no. Forget the God world. Right now, forget. Right now, forget the God world. Forget the God world. Okay. Okay. Listen, listen listen to me. See, this is the same old crap that I dealt with you the last time. You just gibber and you jabber and you don't focus. Now, I want to hear in one sentence. What is we the evidence we support that sentence. indicates that the not God world is true? Right, one sentence. The evidence we support that the God world is not true is that you define the God world as every truth must necessitate <laughs> that God okay, you're making it, okay, you're making the classical appeal. So you're not it's getting not, this. It's not, it's not. You're making it's what you've now it. done is, listen to me, listen to me. When I ask you for evidence we support that the not God world is true, what I don't want to hear out of your mouth is any reference to the God world because it's not right. relevant. That's necessary. Okay? Do you understand? Can, can you focus like a grown man on my I words it. here? I know what you're saying. No, you, no you're not. Listen, Listen, I want you to focus on my words to you, saying. okay? Focus like a laser beam on what I'm mm -hmm. saying to you, okay? Mm -hmm. When mm -hmm. I defend or other theists defend the God world, okay? We, we give evidentiary support or a rationale why it's true. We don't, yeah. we don't say, you don't it hear the, the hey, can you just shut the fuck up for one second? Yeah. Don't. Now, when theists generally, with rare exception, defend theism or Christian theism, They'll either appeal to a rationale or evidentiary support that the God world is true. We don't sit there and say, well, because there's an absence of evidence for the not God world, therefore the God world. Now, once in a blue moon, you might run across a, a stupid theist who, who, who says that. But the majority of theists or Christian theists do not do that. Okay, They appeal to various classical arguments uh they yeah. appeal to teleology or, or design okay they might appeal to the cosmological argument some may yeah. appeal to the transcendental argument okay yeah. but they're not appealing to the absence of uh evidence yeah, for, for the not god world now I, i'm going to ask the same question of you again and i do not want to hear out of your mouth no. otherwise uh, uh, anything about the God world, or I'm yeah. going to pop my cork and I'm just going to start yeah. ripping you verbally. Okay. <laughs> All I want to hear, I don't want to hear anything about the God world from you. What I do want to hear from you is what is the evidentiary support and the rational justification. Okay. For the not God world. The impossibility of the contrary. Okay. That is a non-informative answer. But you won't let me mention the God world, so I'm, I'm no, trying that, to... The possibility of the contrary. contrary. Listen contrary to me. Is the God this world. is a... You okay, won't let me talk about the God world. I can't prove How is it? Okay, listen. Listen to me. I'm well acquainted. I'm well acquainted with this, okay? This is what we call... Now, hold on a second. Listen to me carefully. Listen to me carefully, okay? When you say to the impossibility of the contrary, okay? Yes. You are borrowing from a line of transcendental argument for God that is made famous by Cornelius Van Til and Greg Bonson. Now, when you say to the contrary is impossible, yeah. what you're saying is, is that the God world yes. is impossible. That is what I'm saying. Good. How it, How is the existence of God impossible? Right. So my point was, I have to explain how the God world is impossible without mentioning the God world. Can you say- No, I want to know, is? listen to me carefully. <laughs> How is how is the existence of God the God impossible? world? Okay, let I'm me explain saying, to you. Let me explain yeah. to you the I, only I, I, way I, that you can establish this. Okay. Yeah. Now I'm because saying God, God is defined. Hey, Wildheart, do I sound uneducated on this issue? I'm I'm trying to explain so you don't okay. have to go on for another five minutes. Okay. I'm trying when to you say you that the oh, yeah. not God world is true due to the impossibility of the contrary, all you're yeah. just simply saying is the existence of God is impossible. Jesus, now, the only God. way that you can, oh, wow. I mean, were you born this way? But the reason is you defined it in a certain way. Listen to me was, carefully. Do, do, you, do, you, do you have any, listen to me. Do you have any self-awareness whatsoever 
that you are difficult to talk to as a grown man? I mean, I mean, Do you have any self awareness to, to this? No, no. Okay. Well, you need yeah, to work on that. Okay? I'm not allowed to use words. So it's it okay, it wild heart. Darth is just okay. projecting. Okay. Yeah, just, uh, just. No, actually, actually, I'm not projecting. I I take great pe pains yeah, and efforts to uh, reason like adult with people. The fact of the matter is, what we have is atheists who resort any number of dozens of tactics to be evasive and deceptive. Okay. So. Don't give Actually, me this crap like that I'm. Like, hold on a second. Don't give me. The, okay, shut the fuck up, Wildheart. I'm trying to buy words. Shut the fuck up. It. Now, Wildheart. Okay, <laughs> when you say that the not God world is true due to the impossibility of the contrary, what you're saying is, is that God is impossible. The only way that you could say that God is impossible, okay, is you would have to show us what it is that is ultimate from which all things derive and depend and that it's not God, okay? Yeah. Because God, God by definition, as categorized and defined as the ultimacy of reality, okay, would be yeah. the ground of all possibilities. So God's existence himself would not be subject to some external constraint or, or parameter. So the only way that you could say it is impossible is to tell us what is ultimate and absolute from which all things derive and depend okay and that it's impersonal so i'm going to ask you a very clear question and i want you to answer the question instead of filibustering okay what is it then that is ultimate and absolute out of which all other contingent and temporal things derive and depend but i was trying to answer the question how is the god world impossible i'm okay. saying it's impossible Can you, i will repeat the question again what is it that is ultimate and absolute that is not god yeah um, wow dude are you drunk right now are you drunk are you drunk right now okay then shut up and listen to the question i will i will repeat the question and then i will shut up and then you can answer the question i've not finished one sentence i've not given my answer you change the question i'll repeat the question again i'll repeat the question again what is it that is ultimate i'll repeat the question see i guess you had didn't learn from our last conversation that i'm a dog with a bone Okay, now, what is it that is ultimate and absolute from which all temporality, okay, and contingency derive from that is not God? What is it? Can, can you see that that's a totally different question than the one that I attempted? Okay. What is it that is ultimate and absolute from out of which I don't know, all I contingency I derives? I think you're questions. talking past him, Darth. Like, it's, I would, okay. I would, all right, we're, 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 we're done with it. See, he's not as, yeah. he's not as stupid. He's not as stupid as he pretends to be, but That's this is bad. his, this is his, this is his shtick. This is the mm. one of the many dozens of tactics that atheists will deploy. Okay. In order to uh, evade an examination of the coherency of atheism. He did this the last time I talked with him, I, I, and he's I, doing I, it again. Can I, have, can I have two, possibly five sentences? I'm just still waiting for you to tell me why God is impossible. Well, okay? just, let, Wildheart, just let him say what he has to say so he doesn't just... Wildheart, explain to, me, explain to me why God is impossible. Please, please. Can I just say, uh, Leo Phillips... Yes, go ahead. I'll, 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 I'll let you have the floor. I, I, have I want you to explain ahead. to me yeah. how God is impossible. Right, I, I want to buy right now because someone who's more intelligent and has better answers. I want you to explain to me. Room. Can you explain to me to briefly? Can you explain to me briefly how God is impossible? I can't. You see, this is what this is. What, I don't praise. I don't know you why know you have him on stage. I wanted without being interrupted. You know, you know those things I just asked for. Can I get hey, those? You told me God was impossible. Can you explain how God right, is I was impossible? Wrong. I was wrong. I was wrong. Can you start to leave for this, please? You know okay. So right, hold on right, a second. So no, hold on a second. Hold up, on. Yeah, hold on. So you yeah. don't have evidentiary support for the not god world i'm saying i'm giving up on the conversation no Wildheart, do you have evidentiary support for the not god world i'm 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 just i i'm bowing out okay so okay so he's conceding there's a concession let me let me wrap this up then pray i praise let me wrap this up okay i demonstrated my point that he has a criterion of belief that he says that if it were fulfilled he would believe in god and in the absence of that criterion of belief being fulfilled, yeah, um, so. it's not, no, no, no. in the um, shut the fuck up. So he has a criterion of belief 
as to why he would believe in God. In the absence of it, he dismisses no, God. That's not but he completely abandons this criterion of belief when he adopts the not God world. And we saw it here, the first encounter that I had with him days ago, and again here tonight, he said, when I said, when I said to him, what is the evidentiary support for the not God world? And he says, to the impossibility of the country. So what he's saying is that ev evidentiary support is God is impossible. But when I ask him how and why no, I was, God is impossible, was, he taps out. The God's so world he doesn't that, have evidentiary support. I was saying the God anymore. world in the way you described it is impossible, but you wouldn't like to <laughs> Listen to me very carefully. Listen true. to me very carefully. You wouldn't how like is the existence? How is the existence going on the Listen day. carefully. You see, you don't have conversations with people. How about you listen carefully for fucking once? Okay, I am listening carefully. What I'm listening carefully to is you just spewing gibberish without having an adult interaction with me but okay? i think you're talking I past you I I wild can heart can you please explain to me in one or two sentences why no, god really, is no. impossible no i can't talk to leo okay so do, you see what he, do you see what just happened again for a second yeah, time yeah, here yeah. I'm he, 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 he does not me, provide would you do me a favor if he keeps on over talking would you remove him from the audience please can you understand why that is just dishonest once you, I go right to the conversation, for you to describe what my yeah. feelings are on the conversation. Okay. See, just, see, this is this is what they do. Bicker, 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 bicker. Now, I'm glad to see that we have Leo Phileas here, okay? Leo Phileas, can you tell me why God doesn't exist? This is uncomplicated, and it's really uncontroversial. Okay, shut the fuck up, will you?